Binance dubs barred Russian banks on its platform as yellow and green cards despite the US DOJ investigating Binance for violation of US sanctions with its services in Russia. The firm has continued to promote its platform in the country. News join us on social networks Binance's peer-to-peer, peer-to-peer, cryptocurrency exchange in Russia has continued facilitating transactions through sanctioned banks like Rose Bank after denying relationships with any banks. On August 23rd, Multiple local news sources reported that Binance Peer-to-Peer has renamed some of its troubled payment options for withdrawals and deposits, namely the sanctioned Russian banks like Tinkoff and Rosebank. The Peer-to-Peer exchange replaced the bank's names Tinkoff and Rosebank with terms like yellow and green cards, Cointelegraph has confirmed. At the time of writing, Binance Peer-to-Peer offers customers the use of the local cards to sell cryptocurrencies like Tether, USDT to Russian rubles and receive them on sanctioned Tinkov for Rose Bank. The new naming apparently came shortly after the Wall Street Journal on August 22 reported that Binance offered Russian clients at least five sanctioned Russian banks, including Rose Bank and Tinkov, as options for processing payments. In the Wall Street Journal report, Binance executives denied any relationships with any banks whatsoever, in Russia or elsewhere, in relation to its peer-to-peer platform. Binance follows the global sanctions rules and enforces sanctions on people, organizations, entities, and countries that have been blacklisted by the international community, denying such actors access to the Binance platform. The company said that the news came a few days after Binance services in Russia were promoted. Follow the URL for the full article for more on this story. Visit the news article link.